Betelgeuse, the red supergiant star located on the shoulder of Orion's mighty warrior, has captivated astronomers and stargazers alike with its peculiar and unpredictable behavior. This enigmatic star has been dazzling the night sky, and recently, its fluctuations in brightness have ignited excitement about the possibility of witnessing a once-in-a-lifetime cosmic event. Some scientists speculate that the sudden increase in brightness could indicate that Betelgeuse is preparing for a dramatic end, potentially becoming a supernova. But the big question remains, when exactly will this happen? The timing is uncertain, but experts believe that the star's impending explosion could occur sooner rather than later. Join us as we delve into the latest developments regarding this intriguing celestial body, and if you're eager to stay up to date with the latest cosmic discoveries, be sure to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and turn on the notification bell to stay in the loop. Though you may not be on a first-name basis with Betelgeuse, its bright reddish hue is impossible to miss, and it's likely that you've spotted it shining in the constellation Orion. This star is a true giant, if placed at the center of our solar system, its surface would stretch beyond the orbit of Mars, dwarfing the planets around it. With such an immense size and dazzling luminosity, Betelgeuse has long been a subject of wonder and intrigue. What's more, this colossal star is located relatively close to us in the grand expanse of the galaxy, making it a fascinating object of study. It is a semi-regular variable star, which means its brightness fluctuates in unpredictable ways. This constant change in its light output is a sign that Betelgeuse is rapidly nearing its final stages, and that ultimate end could come in the form of a supernova explosion. The behavior of Betelgeuse has become even more intriguing in recent years. Unexpected fluctuations in its brightness have left scientists scratching their heads. Among the most puzzling of these changes is an event known as the Great Dimming, which occurred between 2019 and 2020. This mysterious dimming caused the red supergiant to lose some of its shine temporarily. But just when scientists thought they understood the star's behavior, Betelgeuse returned brighter than ever before. The star is currently shining at double its usual luminosity, a fact that has left the astronomy community eagerly watching to see what will happen next. This sudden change in brightness has created a unique opportunity for scientists to observe the transition of a star like Betelgeuse, from its current state to its inevitable end as a supernova. Not only has Betelgeuse increased in brightness by more than 50% in recent times, but on May 20, 2023, a Twitter account called Betelbots, dedicated to monitoring the star, reported a truly startling observation, the star's brightness had surged by an astonishing 142%. This data, gathered by the American Variable Star Observing Association, sent shockwaves through the scientific community. Astrophysicist Andrea Dupree, from the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics, noted that Betelgeuse now ranks as the seventh brightest star in the night sky, jumping three spots from its usual position at 10th. It's a remarkable change, and if you find yourself in the southern hemisphere, you can catch a glimpse of this fiery spectacle shining brightly in the evening sky. Even in the northern hemisphere, Betelgeuse is becoming more visible as the days grow shorter. One of the most fascinating aspects of Betelgeuse is how it allows us to witness the final stages of a giant star's life cycle in real time. This is an unprecedented opportunity, as the death of such a massive star has never been studied in such detail before. By observing Betelgeuse, scientists hope to unravel the mysteries of what happens to stars like this before they explode in a supernova. In fact, it is speculated that Betelgeuse could become so bright that it might be visible during the daytime, potentially casting shadows in the dead of night. This is a phenomenon that has drawn the attention of both amateur astronomers and professionals alike, and the possibility of witnessing such an extraordinary event has sent a wave of excitement throughout the global astronomical community. At some point in the future, Betelgeuse will meet its dramatic end in a stunning supernova explosion, one that will be visible to the naked eye. 
while the exact moment of this event is still unknown, the star is currently 650 light years away from Earth, meaning that when it does explode, we will have the opportunity to witness this awe inspiring spectacle from the best vantage point possible. Heidi Morris, a scientist at Los Alamos National Laboratory and president of the Astronomy Club, has emphasized how much fascination Betelgeuse has sparked in the scientific community and beyond. People have been closely monitoring its fluctuations in brightness for years, eagerly awaiting its next phase. Betelgeuse's cycles of intensity and fading have been known to astronomers for centuries, with ancient cultures such as the Aboriginal Australians and the Greeks also documenting its changes in the night sky. Typically, Betelgeuse follows a predictable brightness cycle, lasting about 400 days. However, this cycle has become much shorter, with the star's brightness fluctuating roughly every 130 days, according to Andrea Dupree. This unusual behavior started in 2019, after Betelgeuse ejected a significant portion of its outer atmosphere, causing a massive disturbance. These rapid changes in brightness are not typical of Betelgeuse, raising the question, does this mean the star is nearing the end of its life? According to a paper written by Dupree and other astronomers from Harvard and the University of California at Berkeley, it's estimated that it will be 5 to 10 more years before Betelgeuse returns to its normal brightness cycle. The paper points out that Betelgeuse has been acting in a notably different manner since the Great Dimming, with changes in both its luminosity and radial velocity. Despite these unusual fluctuations, Betelgeuse still has a long way to go before it reaches the supernova stage. As a red giant star, Betelgeuse undergoes a series of complex fusion processes, fusing elements like helium, carbon, oxygen, silicon, and eventually iron. The immense pressure in its core causes helium to fuse into carbon, and as the star evolves, it continues to fuse heavier elements, ultimately forming silicon and iron. These fusion reactions will eventually lead to Betelgeuse collapsing under its own gravity, which will trigger the final stage of its life. The end result could be the formation of either a neutron star or a black hole, depending on the mass of the core that remains after the explosion. Betelgeuse is a stellar giant that has lived a fast and intense life, with a rapid rate of evolution. As it exhausts its nuclear fuel, the core will collapse under its immense weight, triggering an explosion so powerful that it could outshine entire galaxies. This supernova event is inevitable, but predicting exactly when it will happen remains a mystery. Experts, including University of Portsmouth's Professor Peter Grove, who has written extensively on supernovae, argue that there's currently no reliable method for predicting when stars like Betelgeuse will explode. While we know the star is nearing the end of its life, we are still in the dark about the precise moment of its explosive demise. This uncertainty is not surprising, as humanity has only witnessed a handful of supernovae in recorded history. Despite the hopes of astronomers, there's no guarantee that any of us will live to see Betelgeuse's spectacular explosion. However, when the time does come, it will undoubtedly be one of the most breathtaking celestial events to ever grace the night sky. If you found this video fascinating, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with others, and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss out on future videos about the mysteries of the universe. Stay tuned for more cosmic discoveries. Four.